Well, hi guys, it's Jim the PA Woodsman's Channel. It's been a while, folks. I know I've been getting a couple comments and PMs wondering where the hell I've been. Now, you all know I started my new job down at the, uh, the Veterans Hospital. Uh, haven't really got a set schedule yet uh, due to what they have as an orientation program. It can take upwards a month and a half. I have to go sit through a class this week on telemetry. I'm already familiar with the cardiac monitors, but they want you to be taught to their their way of doing things. So, and plus, I need to get familiar with their system, so it's no big deal. Uh, weekends, the last three weekends, I really haven't had off. Uh, I have today off, uh, which is Sunday. Uh, I was thinking about going out in the woods, but I've been battling this really bad head cold and hacking and everything and I really don't want to go out right now. We've been having really goofy weather around here like a lot of you folks have. Uh, anywhere from single digits up to 50 which it was yesterday. Uh, I worked yesterday afternoon. The morning I went out and did some shooting but the wind was just so strong shooting at any type of distance I wasn't able to keep a good group of anything. Uh, well what's planned? Well you haven't seen me do much winter camping, and to be honest with you, uh, I more or less gave that up, that hobby. Uh, this winter has been something a little bit more unusual, than, to say the least. I bought that hot tent thinking I was going to be able to get out more and do all this stuff, and to be honest, I just didn't, didn't have the time. Also, it was a lot of work hauling that in by, by uh, back power, especially knowing how my back sometimes to be irritated. Uh, I had a hell of a time getting it out of the 12 acres the last time I was there up over that hill. So I had a gentleman up in Canada was looking for one and we were able to meet up in Erie and I sold him the tent, the pulp, the wood stove, all that stuff and just got out of winter camp and even got rid of my winter incubator for the hammock. Uh, plan on just anything like 27 degrees up uh, will be my camping. I will still continue to go outside and do bush crafting and stuff like that in the winter. Uh, just don't expect to see me doing any hot tenting stuff anytime soon. May do some cold camping, uh, set up a tarp with a long fire, and my way to sleeping bag, something like that. So, uh, camping season is just a couple months away for the camper. I have to get it pulled out, cleaned up, fill up my two propane tanks. I uh, haven't gotten anything new for it this year. Tax season came and went. I uh, got some work done in some of the vehicles. I need to get some more work done in my Jeep. I have an exhaust leak. I did a bit of gas to put on. And of course now both of my back windows don't like to go up and down. So I got to get that addressed. So my daughter doesn't get mad in the summer when she wants to put, crack her window in the back. So. Planning doing some hiking if I can this year. I know uh, Blister Dave Blister Boy wants to do the North Country Trail. Uh, he's gonna do 100 miles of it and gonna do it in sections though. Uh, Ryan wants to get together and maybe a couple other guys we wanted. We've been talking about now for two years doing the PA Grand Canyon. Uh, this is all gonna gonna have to go around my schedule with work and I got to get used to this. Uh, they called it advanced leave uh, PTO time, well not PTO time, but the way their structure works, you, you apply for a week of vacation. I don't normally take a week's full of vacation. I take it like two days, add a Friday to a Monday or something to make a long weekend. Because my wife's would work, she can't get a week off if she wanted to, uh, unless it was really, well, she probably could, but it would be difficult for her in her position. Uh, that's one thing I do miss about my old job, having that flexibility. Uh, I miss the old job. Miss the uh, satisfaction I got, you know, being a paramedic. Uh, a lot of satisfaction in my new job, dealing with my fellow uh, uh, men and women of the armed forces. Uh, still get to do some of the stuff I used to do as a paramedic. Uh, still get to keep my skills up. Uh, continue on with my continuing education as a paramedic and that because I don't want to ever lose it because you never know what could happen somewhere down the road where I need to fall back on those skills for uh, my family, friends, or even work. Maybe they'll implement something more into the program somewhere down the road. I don't know. 
Uh, other than that, haven't been really doing a much, a bunch of anything. Uh, just working and putting up with the weather. Uh, a lot of freezing rain, snow, getting back and forth to work. Uh, just waiting for the weather to break to do more. Uh, haven't been out to fix my dog's place much. I was out there a couple weeks ago. We did some shooting together. Other than that, uh, just talking on the phone. That's about the extent of it with me and him. But uh, Well, that's it in a nutshell with me, guys. Just been crazy busy working. Haven't been buying much gear or anything like that. Uh, haven't had time for anything. Uh, what gear I have bought and certain stuff I don't discuss on YouTube. Uh, it's prepping type stuff. Uh, I, I, my personal feeling is you keep certain stuff to yourself. Don't want unwanted visitors knowing what you, what you have. Uh, well guys, I'm going to just keep this one short as much as I can. I want to thank you for being patient with me. I've gotten quite a few different subscribers in, over the past uh, couple weeks. And the folks, if I haven't seen, commented on your videos, I apologize. I've been just so crazy tied up busy. So we'll see if I can sort of get caught up here and there. But uh, we'll have to see how the uh, schedule works out. So as always, folks, I want you to thank you again for watching the PA Wisdom's channel. And most of all, God bless.